Hi guys, welcome to the channel. My name is Inna. I'm so happy to have you here for another music reaction. Specifically, today we are checking out Billy Idol White Wedding Part 1. So I'm assuming that there's going to be at least a part 2, potentially maybe a part 3. We will see. But yeah, uh, I have been listening a little bit to Billy Idol, uh, Billy Idol recently here on this channel. And I think that he's just like such a fantastic rock star, a symbol of the 80s, always super fun to listen to. So yeah, I'm super, super excited for this specific song as well. Um, all the other songs that I listen to literally either make me want to dance or just like really make uh, make me focus to the screen I can't get my eyes on the video so I'm super excited for this one so with no further ado we're gonna jump straight into it of course as always friendly reminder to like and subscribe it really helps out the channel so thank you so much if you do that now let's listen Billy Idol White Wedding <laughs> See, I'm already dancing. My shoulder is already going. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, so cool. Okay, I think that white wedding here means something else already. I don't know, like I'm assuming that it's a metaphor for something that I'm not familiar with, but like the bride in the wedding dress on in this uh, like hospital bed with somebody that looks like a doctor slash uh, nurse, I don't know. Um, yeah, I don't think that this is an actual wedding. <laughs> Oh no, we're actually walking into a church now? Looks like a graveyard fall, look at all those crosses. Oh, why does she have blood? It's a nice day for a white wedding. It's a nice day to start again. Ah! Oh. Whoa! I love that scream. He's so cool. Look at him. Nothing. There is nothing safe in no, no, no. Let me listen to that little guitar again. It was kind of in the background, but it was so good. There is nothing safe in this world. Wait, the kitchen is burning. There's something left in this world Start again I'm always a nice day for a white wedding Oh, it's a nice day to start again It's a nice day to start again Oh, and it ends like that, oh! 
yeah okay i'm a little confused by the meaning of the song i'll i'll um, it's not a secret i have no idea what white weddings mean, means in this case because yeah we did have a wedding but the bride was first taken to a hospital bed and then uh, like she was in her kitchen still in her wedding dress and everything was just like falling apart things were catching on fire the the, the water just started going everywhere so whatever white wedding means I don't think that it's a happy marriage. <laughs> but no, actually, I'm very curious. Let me Google that right away. Uh, white wedding meaning. Let's see. Da -da 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 come on, come on, come on, come on. To date, White Wedding remains one of uh, Idol's most recognizable hits, but the song was never as pristine as the title may have hinted. In the song, Idol is singing about his girlfriend who wants to marry someone else. Oh, that's what it means! Uh, so, like, the girl wants to... Like, she's getting married, but she wishes that her broom was somebody else. Um... Oh, it's not entirely about Billy Idol's re real sister. Does that mean that actually, like, uh, it's partially about his sister? Oh, through Idol is singing, Hey, little sister, what have you done? The song isn't entirely about his actual sister, Jane Broad. At the time of writing the song, his sister was getting married and pregnant, which helped inspire the song. But it wasn't all about her sister. It's more of a slang uh, in uh, England for girlfriend, similar to Bay. Okay, got it. Okay, okay, okay. The song also addresses his rock, uh, rock star life and leaving part of his former life behind. I get it. I get it. Okay, definitely. This definitely clarifies it a little bit, as a, a little bit more. Like as I was saying, like I don't think that this is a happy marriage. So I guess that I was right about that point. So yeah, meaning of the song. If you guys want to tell me a little bit more in the comments, of course, feel free to. Cause yeah, uh, I need a little bit of help. Um, but also. I love the beat. I love the 80s. Like, man, I love the 80s so much. The, the sound is so recognizable. Like, it definitely has some, like, synth elements every now and then that just, like, make me make me want to dance. Like, literally, the song started and my shoulder was like, whoa, whoa, we're dancing, huh? Um, so, yeah, even if, like, maybe the lyrics, the topic of this song wasn't super fun, uh, necessarily, the beat still makes you want to, like, stand up and uh, hit the dance floor so i really like this about the 80s and specifically about billy idol i definitely need to listen to a few more of his songs i can tell you that like rebel yell it's probably still my favorite song to date that i heard from from him but please guys let me know uh, what other songs of billy idol you would like me to listen to because yeah i i want to discover his discography a little bit more and thank you so much for being here i really hope that you enjoyed this video if you did, make sure that you hit the like button and you subscribe. We kind of have a goal to make it to 100k subscribers by the end of the year. So thank you so much to everybody that has subscribed. And thank you if you're considering doing so with this video. And uh, yeah, I'm going to see you guys real soon here on YouTube or over on Twitch. Bye! <laughs>